This is a little bay. I'm just going past after coming out from the glacier. I am not going to camp in this one. Look at that hole in the rock over there. That's cool. But look at that scenery. Anybody who's cruised anywhere, let me shake this around and turn it around. Anybody that's cruised anywhere around the world, some of the hottest cruising grounds for sailors, places like the British Virgin Islands, they don't have scenery like that. They don't have scenery like that. And it's so hot out here, I have my shirt off. Because now, now the wind's getting on me, but the sun beating down on me, it got so hot I take my shirt off. Kind of get a little suntan while I'm out here. But just beautiful out. Great day, had fun over in the glacier, dodging ice cubes. <laughs> Some big ones in there, some big growlers. I was afraid that I was gonna hurt the boat, but steered around the big ones and slowly plowed through the little ones. Look at that scenery, huh? Here, let me do a little. There's another glacier up there. More up that way. More out there. Sorry, a little shaky. There's the Pacific Ocean. Some islands out there at the front. And we're going into some little cove through there. I'm sorry, but the glass on my boat's not very good. Uh, it's hard to look through it. Plus, I got the dinghy on the bow, and it's hard to see where you're going. But I'll be there in uh, an hour. It's 3.30 now. I'll get there around 4.30, put down the hook. Thinking about buying another anchor with uh, out chain. Uh, maybe just... Uh, or maybe just, you know, an anchor with 20, 30 feet of chain and a lot of road rope uh, just for a day anchor so I can not have to... Because a lot of these places that I'm anchoring, you know, I don't need heavy ground tackle. I'm anchoring in a spot, you know, that's just... There's nothing, there's no wind, there's no current, there's, you know, the tide moving in and out a little bit, but that's about the extent of it. There's no reason why... I shouldn't just use some uh, little lightweight tackle so it's not so hard pulling the anchor up like it is with that 120 feet of chain on that 35 pound anchor. So, I don't know. Something I'm going to do some research and look into. But, but look at that, guys. For those of you who are sailing around the world, if you don't come up here and sail into Alaska, and I don't mean just southeast Alaska, if you don't come all the way up here into south central Alaska, up around Seward and Whittier and see these glaciers and the snow-covered mountains in your anchorages, you're really missing something. Now this right now today is uh, early May, first week of May I think. What day is it? Today is uh, May 13th. Okay, so the middle of May. I like. And uh, it's warm enough up here I got my shirt off thinking about going for a swim. I did drop the swim ladder into the water just to see how deep it would go. When I pulled it back up out of the water, it was awful cold. So I don't know if I'm quite that brave yet, but thinking about it. A beautiful sunny day out here, just gorgeous. So, and now I'm getting hit with a little wake, but awesome conditions. More later.